welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Becca and this is Curly Girl Budgeting. Today we're going to be unstuffing my cash envelopes from last week and restuffing them for this week. Um, same amounts pretty much as always, so super straightforward, nothing too crazy, but definitely still want to show you guys and stay accountable. So first we'll go through my envelopes. I spent all of my food and gas. Um, once again, Florida had a hurricane come through, Hurricane Nicole. So as a result, we ended up spending more on food. So even though I had leftover in gas, I ended up spending it anyways. So those two envelopes are empty. And then personal, I had to cancel my facial um, from being sick and the storm and all that. So I didn't have to use the money I'd set aside for tip. So I ended up dipping into it a little bit for food. Um, but otherwise we still have 21, 22, no, 20, 21, 22, 23 dollars. And I'm actually gonna leave it in personal because my wife and I are going to see the new Black Panther movie tonight with our AMC A-list subscription, um, but we are gonna go to dinner. So I figure I'll just have that in here instead of having to dip into her envelope and my sinking funds. So we're just gonna go ahead and restuff and then go from there. So for food, I have 120 this week, 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. And this has been working out a lot better. I don't feel so restricted with eating out, which is nice. Um, next week is our last week of classes on campus, so my food should go down being that I'm at home most of the day, but I'll figure for one more month, the rest of this month, basically I'll stick with this amount and see how I do. Gas is getting 40. This was calculated before the storm, obviously, it's when I did my monthly budget. So I calculate both my gas and my SunPass costs based on the exact number of times I have to go to campus. And this coming week, we were supposed to only have class on Monday, and then classes were over. But because of the storm, now they built in makeup days, and we're still not positive what our schedule is going to look like. So we'll see if the $40 in gas is enough. I believe I still have about half a tank. So that'll get me there and back once, and this $40 is another two trips. So it's just going to depend on how many days I'm required to go to the city. But we have what we have, and we'll make it work. And then last is personals 25 and this is for my massage that's supposed to happen this Sunday, right? Yeah, Sunday. So I'll use that 25 for that. And like I said, the rest is for dinner tonight. So that is all I have for this week. I know the storm kind of threw me for a loop with my budget. Let me know how your guys' budget's going. If anything has popped up recently that's made it a little more difficult. And just remember, no matter what, we'll get through it because we plan as best we can and then we go from there. So that's all for today. Thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.